Hello friends, welcome back to lmzilly.com. In today's screencast, we will be learning about a plugin named as User Bulk Enrollment, which allows the teachers to bulk enroll a list of users only by using their email address instead of using a proper CSV file, which generally the admin works. And this method can help the teachers to enroll a lot of students easily by going through only their email addresses. So let us see how this user bulk enrollment plugin works for the teachers. You can download this plugin from the official plugins repository uh, in Moodle. And once you download, so I will just show you how it will work. So you need to click download and here. Now you need to go back to your Moodle site, go to site admin. I am logged in as the admin user of this Moodle site. So just go to the plugins page and then click on install plugins. And here just drop the file which you have downloaded from the Moodle plugins repository and click on install plugin. Then it will go through a series of checks. So click continue. And then just go to the bottom and click continue. And then click upgrade Google database now. So we have installed the plugin now on our Moodle site. So let us click continue here. So here on this page, you can uh, use uh, the different settings for this user bulk enrollment plugin. On the first uh, setting, you can see the enrollment plugin. So which enrollment method to be used for bulk enrollment. So uh, while using this plugin, you will enter the list of the email address of the students and they will be enrolled in the course. But which enrollment method will be assigned to them is selected here. So you can choose either the manual enrollment or guest self enrollment or cohort sync. So let me choose manual enrollments here. And then you can define the role which will be assigned to the users selected through this plugin. You can choose all the roles uh, mentioned here on this list. So by default, it is set to student. And then you can see the navigation node placement. So where you would like to and, uh, add the link for this user bulk enrollment. As of now, it is added to the participants page and then you can add it to directly to the course navigation or you can add it to the both pages. So let me keep it uh, same and the participants page jump menu. So afterwards, just click save changes. So after installing the plugin, let me go to a course in Moodle. And here on the course uh, page, you can go to the participants tab here. And then on this page, you will see all the enrolled users in the course. And let me expand this drop down. And here you will see the user bulk enrollment link on the bottom. So just click on this one. Now uh, on this page, you will see a field where you can provide the email address of all the students uh, which needs to be enrolled in this course. Kindly note that all the ad email addresses has to be entered in one email address per line in this field. And second, they shall have a account in Moodle already created for them. If they do not have any account created in Moodle, then this plugin will not enroll them in this course. It will directly skip that user who is not having any account. So let me enter the student accounts here. I already have a uh, list of the email address which uh, are already created as a student on this Moodle site. So let me add two of them. And kindly note that there needs to be no extra space or uh, any special character after this uh, email address. 
and then once you have added the email address of all the students then just click on enroll users button here now on this page you will see the list of the users who will be enrolled into the course and you can also see the enrollment details like uh, which enrollment method will be used and which role will be assigned to these users then just click on enroll users button here so you can see that we have enrolled two students in our course by using the user bulk enrollment plugin and through this same way you can enroll multiple users in your Moodle course just by entering their email address. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this video please don't forget to click the subscribe button as well as press the bell icon for our YouTube channel. It will really help me to create more engaging content for you in the future. Thank you. Have a great day.